so I just found out that this is another video without sound because unfortunately I did this opening on the same day as the uh, Stardom Rebirth for You opening but anyway uh, here is the latest products from Build Divide we have two booster box of the volume 4 set as well as two trial decks to go through today uh, personally, I think the artwork for the later sets do look a lot better uh, compared to Volume 1 and 2. I'm just uh, curious to see how much uh, better the artwork can get as Aniplex continue to build on this game. So, I don't buy a lot of Build Divide anymore because I have stopped playing personally since Volume 2. But still, I would like to open some of the stuff to see uh, how the artwork is. But since I'm not so heavily invested anymore, uh, I won't be buying boxes to form decks. So anyway, yeah, uh, these are the trial decks. And uh, I will be back again at the end of the video to do a summary and yeah hope you guys enjoy this video and once again i apologize for the technical difficulties i will check my equipment the next time i do uh, more video recordings so yeah see you guys at the end of the video
Okay, I'm just going to jump in very quickly here, but it is a divide rare. And this is the second divide rare that I have opened for build divide despite opening many, many boxes. But uh, it is good reason why they are so rare. Uh, I heard that in the case of booster boxes, there is only uh, one to two divide rare per case of 30 booster boxes. So yeah, these are incredibly rare. But despite that, the prices seems to stabilize around 6,000 to 7,000 yen for the divide rare. So even though it is a very nice card, uh, I do like the signature on this a lot. But unfortunately, it doesn't seem to be worth as much compared to those, uh, you know, SSP or SEC rares uh, from White Source. But yeah, that's that's a very nice card.
Yep, so that was the opening of the Volume 3 and 4 trial deck as well as two booster box of the Volume 4 set. So for the Ultra Rare, it seems that we have two per box. Uh, of course, not counting the Premium Parallel. So yeah, that is always a bonus on top of the two guaranteed per set. And not only that, but you get an alternate foiling on top of the Ultra Rare standard foiling. And Ultra Rare are also nice because they are usually a bit more uh, expensive compared to the other cards because if you can notice the Buster icon which means that their card effects are usually better and that's why people want to play them in a deck. So not only that but today we were also fortunate enough to pull a Divide Rare. I do like the artwork on this card. I think the signature is very nice. And I think Anyplex is really starting to invest in their game. We do see the artwork getting better, as well as the announcement of some very interesting collaboration. We have Demon Slayer upcoming in the June-July period, as well as Fate Stay Night in the September period. So I already pre-ordered those. So do subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, so that you will be first to see uh, those openings as soon as I get them. And yeah, I'm really excited to see how those cards will look like. Anyway, uh, take care, stay safe, and see you all next time. And thank you for watching.